I welcome you all with love. Today I'm going to talk about a, a topic that's actually been a little bit confusing to me, so I did some research to try to straighten it out, which is nitrates and nitrites, and why is it, and I'm going to explain this to you, that nitrates in plants are actually very good and very healthy for us. Why is it that nitrates in animal uh, products, and meat in particular, are actually carcinogenic? Wow, how can that be? They're both nitrates. Well, there's a whole biochemistry to it that makes a lot of sense. The way the physiology works is nitrates are converted to nitrites. We don't want to take that tritely now. Nitrites by bacteria in our mouth. Then they reach the stomach. Now here's the thing that makes the difference. In the stomach, the plant nitrates, which are also associated with polyphenols and vitamin C that we get in the vegetables, okay, that we're eating, and, and, and okay, are converted to nitrous oxide, NO, okay, which is extremely good for us, which I'll explain in a moment. But in animal uh, nitrates, goes to nitrites, along with that comes animal protein and heme, like iron, heme, blood. And those converted to N nitrosamines, which are carcinogenic. And that's the story. It's that simple, but that elegant. So, what we know about night, uh, animal nitrites and nitrates is that they get converted to carcinogenic compounds. That's the key. And we're talking about, according to the International World uh, Health Organizations, uh, it, it is, is if you just have three pieces of bacon or one sausage, you're going to increase, on a weekly basis, you're going to increase your rate of colorectal cancer by 20%. That's significant. Other research, and these are multiple research efforts, hundreds of research papers, shows that women exposed to animal nitrates have higher rates of breast cancer later in life. So we have colorectal cancer and breast cancer. And there's lots of research backing this up in a, in a major way. So it's a major statement. Night, animal meat, flesh, nitrates are indeed carcinogenic. Clear. So, but we don't want to want, run away from plant-based nitrates because they actually are extremely good for our health. Well, what do I mean by that? Well, they produce nitrous oxide, NO. NO is extremely important for improving circulation to the brain, to the heart, to the genital area. It, it is released, uh, the NO uh, is, is released from the endothelium, which is the lining of our arteries, okay? And it also improves circulation, as I said, the, to the heart, to the brain, to the general area, and also greater circulation improves mitochondrial function which is really important because those are the energy factories. So what's the result of that is we can lower blood pressure. And if it, we know anything about heart disease, we know that they actually use uh, nitrate compounds, but uh, to dilate, which is what we're talking about. So it improves circulation, dilates, the arteries, particularly to the brain and to the heart, and also prote protects against coagulation, blood clotting. These are extremely good things. Other research shows that the increased brain blood flow uh, to areas, particularly of memory, is really enhanced by, again, the nitrous oxide. 
So it's a win-win-win on many levels. And actually, we're, we're talking about this almost as an anti-aging effect. So when there's increased blood flow, there's increased oxygenation. When there's increased oxygenation, all our cells work better, the mitochondria work better, and ultimately, we live longer. So what I'm saying is the nitrates from the animal uh, uh, is not what we want. But from the plant, it is what we want. So what are the high nitrate plants? Arugula is one. Beets are another. Uh, spring leafy greens are another. Butter leaf lettuce is another. And these do really make a difference. So my advice is go with your high nitrate um, plants and create an anti-aging and uh, heart supporting, brain supporting intake. So I highly recommend these foods, the high nitrate foods, and may you be blessed that your brain works better, your heart works better, and there's more sexual function. Blessings to you, and may this information enhance your life. Amen. Shalom. Om Shanti Shanti. Om Atakyasana.